I got a new planner and it doesn't start with happy. Hey y'all, this is Kendra from Kendra the Plan. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thank you for coming back. I'm really excited today and I appreciate everyone who clicked on this video. Go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And should you have it in your heart, please hit the subscribe button. Today, I have a planner. I am super, super excited. If you cannot tell, I have a new planner and it ain't a happy planner. And I am just so thrilled and excited to have this i'm sure you guys can tell by the title of the video whose planner it is but you don't know which one i got right are you excited to see i have the new if i could get it open i have to be careful with this letter opener because i always cut myself i have the new kelva plan planner, planner but she has three new planners out if you're not aware they are all three still for sale. Ah, which planner did I get? Okay, so let's just get the particulars out the way. She has three new planners out right now. One is for 2024. One is a vertical floral planner with a neutral gust inside. Uh, the other one is a seasonal planner with, I think it just has a touch of seasonal on the inside and that's vertical. And then there's this baby. Yes, indeed. Any and all of her planners come in, in a box, in its own little planner box, which is super exciting. And I got ah, the dashboard planner. I'm so excited. Let's put that off to the side there. All right, I got myself situated. Maybe we can bring this in a little bit now. Now that we've got it all together. Okay. I got a few other things as well, but let's just do the planner and then we'll get into the other things because I'm super excited. This is a classic size planner. It has a black metal disc, which I'm excited about having the black metal disc. Um, it is a black and white neutral floral type planner. So we have here, okay, maybe putting this box here wasn't the best idea. Oh, okay travesties okay is that better can you guys see everyone can see okay okay so this one is again a black and white floral planner as neutral as it's gonna get this is your year planning a life i love which is heather from kelleville plans little slogan and it's from january to december she's two sticker books that say planning a life i love too as well they're really cute um and dashboard planner this is her version of a dashboard planner also this cover is um double-sided so i think i'm gonna like it with the white side on the front i don't know let's just i think i like this better and I absolutely love that she did a double side like that because I like this better and I was just able to do that. Okay, let's get into the planner. Okay, I forget what pound paper this is, but the, one of the reasons I'm so excited to try this planner is I have heard the rumors from all the girls. The girls have said her paper quality is it. It's where it's at. It's premium. It's nice. They love it. It's buttery and it feels good. So here we have my year to glance right here. Really exciting. Looks really cute. Important dates. I don't know what I'm gonna use this for, but I'll figure it out. And then here is my, um, what is this called? The perpetual calendar, I believe. Last year, like in my classic catch-all planner, I used this for birthdays and I'll probably do the same again this year. Um, but this planner I'm not using as a catch-all, but we'll get to that later. But I enjoy having this. The grayed out days you see there, those are weekends. Okay, and then I have just a completely blank page here that I could do whatever I want, make it into what I want. Um, I think I have a small idea, like I've been thinking about this. Okay, so stay tuned for that. Okay, and then over here we have a double-sided January divider. 
So there is no monthly on the other side of the divider. And then we have just this blank page here. Not sure what I'm gonna do with this one yet, but I can, I'm sure I'll come up with something. Still just completely neutral florals. And then we go into the monthly page here. The difference with her monthly page is these are like um, hand lettered here. It says this month, but then the uh, sidebar is going to be on your right side versus the left side versus, you know, other brands. And then also, I really like her dates. I like the font that she used for her dates. And then this, this right here is her genius idea of a dashboard. And when I say I'm so excited to do this, this is the week, the dashboard week. And then the left side of the dashboard is completely blank dot grid paper. All it has is January, which means I can make this into whatever I want, however I want. I don't have to white out each section, white out a bunch of lines. I could do whatever I want. I am so excited to use this, y'all. Um, over here on this side, the dashboard side is a little different as well because, you know, this is her version. So the blank uh, the blank box is usually up in the corner with other brands and hers is in the bottom corner, which I appreciate also because the bottom corner is where one of the places I like to decorate a lot in my dashboard. So that is something different as well. And then hand lettered dates. So each week is going to be like that. So we're going to go straight into the divider. Okay, so here's the one thing if I had to point out one thing because I mean, we're human, we all point out one thing. This is the one thing I did not like during the fit through and I have actually been trying to figure out in my head how I'm gonna get around this. This would be like the end of the month, right? You could use it as, you know, your currently page. For my dashboard right now, I set a monthly goal page. The only thing I don't like about this is that it has the floral on the spine. I would have wanted just completely neutral dot grid paper which I might end up just ordering some some from somewhere because I want to make this into what I want to make it into without having the florals and without having to cover up the florals because what if I'm doing a scene that doesn't have florals you know so that would be my only gripe I saw when I saw the flip through from Heather okay so then this is the February um, divider she said it's the opposite between black and white each month Again, a blank monthly page. We have our monthly set up again. And it goes straight into the weekly so that we could just look at each divider. Again, the blank page with the florals on the spine. So again, this is a white one, double-sided divider. So that's March. I like this. This is really pretty. Then this is the April divider with the April page. May. June, July, August. Oh, this one's really pretty too. I like this one. September, this one too. And then you can also color these in. Like September, you might want to color those in sunflower colors, even though that's not a sunflower, but you get what I'm saying. October, I like this a lot. November and December. Ooh, that's really, really pretty. And then we're back to um, my double-sided divider. Okay. So that is my dashboard Calvo plan planner. I'm super, super excited about this. Again, these are black metal discs. You guys know I'm a metal disc girly. Um, and this is still available on her website. I will try to remember to link it down below. It's not an affiliate link, but I will try to link it down below. And it comes with this black cover, but again, you can make it whatever you want it to be. So I feel like this is a planner who actually listened to what the people want. Okay? Like what the girls really want. Because Heather plans herself number one she's she's been in the community way longer than really anybody i know but um she just she just really put the thought and time into it and you can tell and i'm appreciative of that okay these are a few other things i got during the release i got this watercolor florals um 
2024 planner set sticker book. This matches the um, watercolor florals planner that she came out. It's in a vertical in the size classic. And then also I got these planner covers from her. I don't want to take them out the plastic yet because I'm not going to use them. And I see you guys have a glare. But I got one in purple, which is still available in her site. And then I got one in pink as well. Both in classic size. Because... I am parent, preparing for my 2024 lineup. So let's do a quick flip through of this sticker book, which we're gonna have to do it this way because I didn't think to leave room for the pole right there. Okay, difficulties. I could not pass up these florals. Originally I was gonna get the dashboard sticker book, but once I saw it and I saw how much lined floral it was in it and I was like ah oh, that's too much lined floral for me but then I saw this sticker book and I was like girl girl yes I need it gotta have it this whole set matches each other and they're all paper and then these are clear stickers the florals are clear they are so so pretty and each set's gonna be like that so it's gonna be colorful boxes and I want to say this is like a 40 page sticker book. Sorry, it's not straight, but I'm doing the best I can with what I have. So look at these colors, they're really cute. Then you have some um, colorful boxes. I'm sorry, you have some decorative boxes, some colorful boxes. And look, there's only four decorative boxes. If you know, and you've been around for a while, you know I used to say there was too many of these full ones. And now you have some with a little bit of deco in it, but you could still write in it. Like, I could do this all day. I could do this too. I love that. Thank you, Heather. And she has header boxes now. Like, I'm telling you, she's been listening. She's been listening. Then you have colorful, monthly colorful boxes monthly decorative boxes and then you have two pages of clear foils and then it just keeps going these are looking like springtime colors monthly boxes and then look at the florals look how bright these are these are definitely for spring love that and this you don't have to wait till 2024 to use my unfortunately i have to wait to use my planner <laughs> okay and then this one, this colorway here is really pretty with a little touch of purple. So I'm still getting a bit of spring colors. Monthly. Yeah, those are spring. Is that what's on the cover? I think that's what's on the cover. Two pages here. And then we got some pastels. Pastels, you guys know I love pastel colors. I have some colorful boxes and some decorative. Ooh, these are a vibe. Some monthly functional boxes. Ooh, yes. Love these. Two pages. And then this is giving them Easter vibes. Monthly, monthly decorative. And then these florals go on the side. Ooh, I like that she switched it up. I do like that. Okay, and then here we have some um, header stickers. Uh, we have this week, this month, important priority, to-do list, work tasks, don't forget errands, laundry, chores, today, tomorrow, to do, off work, clean, bills due, appointment. I usually don't read all this. I don't even know why I started. Upcoming, ooh, that's a good one. Top three next week, groceries, release, day, pay, bills, task. And you get two pages of those. These are all in color. And I really like this font. Heather, can we get a page of this with black? Can we do that? I like this font. This new font she's using. I feel like she used it. I used some of this font in the um, in her recent box as well. And then we have currently prompts. These are paper stickers. I don't know if I mentioned that. But these currently are in color as well. Cooking, planning, dreaming, feeling, believing, crafting, reading, watching. Grateful for working towards drinking, eating. Boom. Saving for it. Oh, that's a good one too. Again, love, love, love this font. And two pages of that. So that is what I got from the brand new um, California Plan Fall Release. Is that what we're gonna say now? 
So is the question is every year, are we going to be, see this has a glare, so I don't know if I wanna put that down, but I did get two covers. Is the switch gonna be happening more and more every year from nameless brand to Kelova plan? I don't know, we'll see. It, it looks like it, the trend is starting. I'm really excited to try this planner. I'm going to give you guys um, an honest opinion and you guys are going to be there every step of the way as we go through it. We're going to write on it. We're going to put our stickers on it and see how they peel up because you guys know how I feel about my stickers not peeling up so well like they used to on nameless brand paper. So um, yeah, let me know down below if you guys got anything from Heather's. Uh, fall release or if you're planning on getting anything and if you are what did you get what are you planning to get did you get a sticker book and no planners did you just get a planner i would love love to hear stay tuned for quote of the day and as always you guys stay positive be blessed love y'all peace